In this video, I'm gonna share with you our best free intro templates for CapCut. Now, first you're gonna get the grunge intro template. Next, you receive the free fire titles template. And finally, the game intro template. Now, all the download links are in the description in the box of this video. You can download each template for free. So you can go ahead, download them, and let's start making the intros inside CapCut together. So now we start with the grunge intro template. And that's super easy to edit. Let me show you how everything works. But before you do any type of editing inside CapCut, the desktop version of CapCut, we need to make a setup. So go to CapCut, Settings, and here you go to the Edit tab. And there you're going to find something called Free Layer. And you must make sure that this one is checked on. Very important. Otherwise, we won't be able to stack the layers one over the other. Okay, click Save. And now we can really begin. So once you downloaded the template, you'll find a folder structure like this. All I want you to do is just take the QuickTime PNG folder, open it, and select all of the videos from it, drag it to the media box, and we're almost done okay we're not done we're just beginning so let's add the base to the timeline like this and this is going to add our base animation now over this i'm going to add the text and you can add your logo i'm going to just add a text layer let's click on the plus sign at default text okay i'm gonna just call this intro video I'm going to change the color to black and I'm going to just select this one again and position it so position it so that it's in the, in the white box there. Okay, let's make another text. Click on the plus, plus sign, add it at the top of the other one, call it template. Okay, select it again, move it into the red box. And this is already looking good. Now the next part is to add the transition effect, the reveal effect. So there it is. It's called reveal. So let's just add that over the top of the text. Now, again, if, if, if this is not working for you, go back and make sure that you have clicked on the free layer thingy. Okay, so what do we have here? Oh, we can see the reveal already moving over it. So what you got to do at this point is make sure that you're at the spot where the reveal effect completely covers your text layers. And then just trim your text layers at to this point, like this. And let's preview the video. And right here, we want it to have a little bit more animation, more movement. So I'm going to add the base loop here and over it i'm gonna just extend the two text layers like this select each text layer extend it again this could be your logo i'm using here a text and over this i'm gonna add the upper loop and once you add this upper loop it's gonna add some really cool movements to the animation and as you can see you have these circles that are being drawn okay Let's preview our animation in like this. And as you can see, the text appears and then we have this little extra movement, little extra animation. Now all you can do is just do, go ahead and export this. Now you have your first intro. Okay, now let's move on to the next one. So now you see, it's so simple to make your intro animation. You have your first one. If you like this video, please click that like button so I know that you enjoy these videos. Now, let's move on to the next one and let's make another intro. So now let's make the Fire Titles intro together. This is going to be super simple. It's exactly on the same structure that you've seen before. Okay, so now we have here the Fire Title template. Once you downloaded it, you'll find these these folders and files in it okay so again take the mov png folder open it up and just drag and drop all the four videos inside your media panel okay start with the base then add your first text let's see first first let's see what we have here 
how this looks okay so let's add our first text like this let's move it up let's add our second text and let's move that one down okay now let's position the text the bo both of the text layers here at the right spot okay let's center it now that looks nice very good so at this point you could change the text the color of the text you can actually change the the text itself and go ahead and change it i'm gonna just leave it like this and the next step is to go to the media panel and there we're gonna add our reveal okay so just drag your reveal layer here and let's preview what we've done okay and i'm gonna show you here a trick you see the reveal appears makes the text appear here and right there's a there's a point where the text disappears for a second and i want you to cut the text at that point okay let's cut it to that point boom we are making magic here let's preview this i i think this looks so realistic with that explosion and the the fire moving i i love this template okay now we're gonna add also the base loop in continuation of the base we're gonna extend the two text layers like this and then we're gonna add the upper loop just above the text layers and let's preview this and you see wow the tiger claws are appearing out of fire wow. I think that looks awesome okay if you agree just let me know in the comments okay now we can export this as a video or we can just start our new video let's start the next one let's do that together so now let's edit together the game titles template now once you've downloaded that template you'll find again a zip file you unzip in that and and in that you'll find a folder called moe png just go ahead select all four video files drag it to your media panel okay and then start with the base let's add the base let's preview the base what's your turn okay now let's add some text go to the text default text position the text at the right place and also we want to position it at the right spot here and let's add another text layer add it to the right spot move it up i want to make this one slightly smaller so it fits and again you can play with the colors you can change the text i'm not going to go into that part now go to media and now just drag in the reveal file and let's let's preview this so there's a point where the text magically disappears boom and i want you to cut the text exactly at that point like this kind of bam the text appears how cool is that okay now let's continue this with the base loop at the bottom extend the text layers you already know you've already seen it and i'm just gonna show you the rest okay so at the top we're gonna add the upper loop like this and the upper loop will add that effect and then we're done so let's preview this together wow i i just love it i think this is so cool and it's so simple you see it's simple it's fast it's easy and it's also free so if you don't have this downloaded by now make sure that you do download it and if you like this video please drop a comment and make sure that you check out my next video that's coming up right here